Hello students! So welcome back to our weekly lesson for our Science 4. We are now in week 5. For week 5, the learning objective is for you to demonstrate ways to minimize harmful changes in materials such as restriction of burning of waste materials and care in handling reactive materials. So please be guided with this objective. For this day one, we will first have to describe the human activities that may disrupt the cycle in the environment. So this is the specific learning objective for this day. Did you get it? Okay. So first, let us watch this video. Pay attention. Afterwards, there will be questions. Now, all together, please read the paragraph. Alright. So, my dear students, as you all know, there are different activities that humans like us are doing that sometimes disrupt the cycle in our environment. What are these? First, let us read this passage. The first one is deforestation. Alright, please read it silently. Very good. So, deforestation, as you have watched, and at the same time read from the passage. So, when you say deforestation, based from the picture, who can tell us? Alright, good. Next, another one, another activity, is water pollution. So, this activity is one of the activities that damages our, alright, our aquatic areas our water areas and when we keep on polluting it we call this as water pollution please read so as you can see here in the picture can you describe this picture can you tell us indeed very good next another activity that disrupt the cycle in our environment is what we called air pollution. Please read. Okay, so this is the picture that tells us that air is polluted because of this. Okay, because of the dirt or the chemicals coming out from factories and other factors. So let us answer these questions. So don't, don't forget class, some human activities bring negative impact or changes in the environment. Who can elaborate this? Thank you. So for your activity, please do this. Another questions? There are two questions here, please answer. Well said, thank you. So here is an example of our day two. Learning objectives. Demonstrate ways to minimize the harmful changes in the environment. All right, so you can download this PowerPoint. Please check the description. So feel free to edit. Or if you want, you can do, use this in your real lesson or you may just pause this video. So to the students, you can have this as your references. Day 3. Alright, day 4. Describe proper care in handling reactive materials. Alright, video. And for last is reflection or any assessment to be given. So you can download.